The Great Barrier Reef is not only an Australian landmark, but one of the most impressive natural wonders in the world. As a little girl, I remember seeing the Great Barrier Reef for the first time. I remember the vast array of colours and shapes. It was just teeming with life. It is home to countless species, but the Great Barrier Reef's beauty is matched by its fragility, and I'm worried. I'm worried because this incredible ecosystem is under major threat. So much so, it is thought that this 2,000 plus kilometres of life may well be dead by the time I'm in my 60s. The problem is global warming and ocean acidification both of which are a consequence of carbon emissions from human activity. The corals depend on a unique algae for their survival. The microalgae provide coral with nutrients and the colour pigment that makes them so beautiful. This symbiotic relationship fails when water temperatures rise, causing coral to lose their colour and become bleached. And while corals may be able to survive bleaching, Prolonged heat stress will eventually lead to mass die-off. In fact, it already is. The Great Barrier Reef also faces a double whammy of ocean acidification. The oceans become more acidic when they absorb atmospheric carbon dioxide, and the acidic seawater reduces the ability of coral to flourish. It's easy to say that this is happening on such a grand scale that it's out of our control, but it isn't. We can all do our bit here. I think it starts with education, learning about the Great Barrier Reef in all its beauty and what impacts we are having on it. Preserve our reefs by reducing your carbon footprint and teach your kids about this as well. Find out more about big projects such as the Adani Megamine. Look at what that will do to our Australian ecosystems and have your say. I believe each and every animal has as much right to be here as you and I. And if you believe this too, and you're an animal lover and nature lover like me, head over to my website, www.drclairestevens.com and sign up to my mailing list.